Romeo. Un nome, una storia, una leggenda. È un'epopea al di fuori del tempo, quella della prestigiosa. Una gloriosa edizione da un Hey, Gub here. Welcome to the fifth episode of What's in the Box. <coughs> if you missed previous episodes of this series, which you probably did because I don't have a lot of views on that, you can go in the description and watch them or you can see them in the playlist. In the last four episodes, I unboxed premium active noise cancelling headphones and this episode will be the same. So for today, I bought this. These are the quite new Bowers and Wilkins PX. It's actually their first attempt at wireless headphones. Oh, in my opinion, they are the best looking headphones on the market. So let's unbox them, shall we? This is a very nice looking box. They feel heavy. They even feel heavier than the Momentum. Here you can find all the specs, but hey, who cares about that? Let's unbox them. It's almost the same system used by Sennheiser. Only this one it's working much better than their box. Oh my god, look at that! Candy! Oh yeah, and the headphones. And look at the design of the cups, they are hollow inside. They feel heavy. I don't know how comfortable they will be for a long use, but man, they look amazing. Wow. This is a ballistic nylon material, which apparently is very resistant. And the ear cups as well. And this uh, cable as well. I mean, look at this. And they slide so nicely. There's no ratchet, no nothing. It's a high quality stuff. Let's put them to the side here and you can admire them while I'm looking at the box. Here you have a very nice looking carrying case. Look at that. And it's magnetic. I don't know how much protection all these offer, but man, all these are manuals which you can just throw away. So inside you have a USB Type-C cable. So these are the first headphones that use this USB Type-C cable to charge them. I'm not sure if it's working as an audio source as well, but I will check and I will inform you. And this is a 3.5 to 3.5 millimeter headphone cable. Nothing is labeled here, which it might be required to look in the manual, but no, we are too good for that, so we'll figure this out. And this color combination, it's amazing. It's so much better than the black ones. And the ear caps are magnetic, I mean, look at that. What can you ask more for? You, you don't even have to align them, you just put them here and they snap into place. Pop. Let's see how they look on my head. You can even feel the passive noise cancelling and I did not even power them on. And the music already started. They have a proximity sensor, so when you take them off, the music just pauses. You put them on. Take them off. Put them on. Take them off. Put them on. Off. If they were on the market more than one year ago, when this appeared 
I would have spent 400 euros on these, not on these. These are absolutely amazing. They are a bit heavy, but uh, I don't know how uncomfortable they will be. They are not uncomfortable, they are just a bit heavy. Stay tuned for my full review on this, as well as for the comparison with my other noise cancelling headphones that I have. But man, these are amazing. I'm, I'm in love. See you next time, and don't forget to subscribe. This is genius, why nobody does this? Do you take the headphones out and the music stops? You put them back in. I mean, look at this, it's amazing. It's like magic. And look, magnets. What else can you want? Well, go now. Uh, hey, hey, hey. Oh shit. <laughs> Too much.